is is her background, what she has done, what she, how she proved herself. In every campaign, when I've watched her, she just shows pictures of her, what she has done in her life. And it's like, oh yeah, that just says it right there to me. And not only that, she's a woman. No, this is my second president that, I'm gonna say president, cause she's gonna, she's gonna do it. So uh, yeah, it's my second president I'll see in my you know, life, maybe more, but uh, yeah, I'm very excited. We got up at five o'clock in the morning, you know, yes. Praise the Lord, yes. Very much excited she's here. And I uh, really, you know, like, like her very much and, the, and, and Mr. Clinton, uh, the whole Democratic, I've always been Democratic and I always been the Democratic Party. Yes, sir. Very happy here that I, I've been supporting them all over the, the town, been canvassing and having, having people, who, you know, to vote, let's make, urging them to vote. It's very important. I go, it's muy importante vote, you know. So uh, that's, that's I, I do encourage everybody to vote this this uh, election. It's very exciting that Pueblo is always on the map for presidential candidates. Uh, we know we just had Trump here, uh, but I'm proud to be supporting Hillary Clinton when she's here in Pueblo today. I say first and foremost, she supports the belief that we should not have privatized prisons in the United States. It's been an issue for me for a very long time. Of course, I support a woman being president, and I believe she's the right woman. And I believe her experience as Secretary of State will make her a stable elected president to deal with places like North Korea and with Russia. I've seen her before, but this is very exciting. I would put it right up to the experience of meeting Barack Obama, but also a great woman like Ann Richards from Texas. Divide us. 